feel like I'm athletic enough to do the spread, read option stuff. Um, but definitely play within their strengths. Um, Coach Rod's like, you know, we got a lot of young guys, really talented young guys, but I think we have a good opportunity, a good chance to come in and compete. So. You've, got, you've got some some receivers who are also new to Illinois, yeah. so you're kind of all new together, I definitely. guess. How long does it take that chemistry to, to evolve, or, or is it starting up already? Uh, we kind of started it up back in July. Um, Josh and Trayvon came here two, three weeks before camp, so we were we were getting routes on the air, uh, getting adjusted to each other, feeling each other out. Um, and then when we came out here, live speed, you know, it's just all about getting reps and you know, seeing what their strengths are and their weaknesses are as well. What's been the, uh, I guess, what's been the, I guess, toughest part of the adjustment, and and what's been like, as I say, really stimulating about it? Um, I really haven't noticed anything that's been tough so far. You know, I, I mean, all the guys are really accepting here. And, it felt like a great family environment when I first got here. Um, I mean, I came right in. The adjustment really wasn't hard at all for me. Um, it was kind of, you know, definitely going to miss Ann Arbor. You know, I love Ann Arbor. I love the university. Um, so coming to a new place, you know, I'm going to miss it a little bit. But, you know, it's also exciting to meet new people, uh, play for new coaches. Coach Levy, you know, he has a lot of experience in the NFL and stuff. So, yeah, it's really cool. What was your de degree in Michigan? What did you end up graduating in? Uh, so the fastest way, I, I kind of picked the fastest way I could kind of graduate. Um, I took 43 credits the last, the last two semesters in Michigan. Um, but I did general studies. OK. Um, so it was a general studies degree? Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Art, art school. Uh -huh. but yeah, that was the fastest way I could wow. graduate. Um, so I did it. Gave myself an opportunity to have two years somewhere else. Yeah, what, now, what do you, what the graduate program do you have to be in here? Uh, I'm choose? doing sport management. Okay, there's, there's, a, there's a degree yeah, in yeah. management in there? Yeah. Okay. okay. I'm, I'm going I'm to try to get a little um, video here, too, if you don't mind. Just kind of really ask you the same. Uh, or maybe I'd ask, what, what's, 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 what's something that somebody should have asked you about now that nobody has? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, couldn't tell you. I don't think there is a question out there that someone hasn't asked yet. Brandon, second week of uh, camp now. We've had a chance to talk to you last week at Media Day. Now you're in your second week in the offense a little bit more. What do you see from this offense as the second week rolls on? Uh, I think the guys are playing with a better tempo, faster, being more aggressive. Uh, I think we're starting to understand and get a good feel for what the defense is doing. Um, and I think we're just playing in a better groove. These guys are playing faster. Justin pretty well to Rod's offense? Yeah, for sure. Um, you know, it wasn't too tough to pick up. Mm -hmm. um, just got to get used to the fast tempo, um, making fast decisions, that kind of stuff. Because I have a lot of weapons out there, and Daniel Barker today was just catching everything. And, you know, Is you get Daniel Barker, the tight end, 87. Oh, oh, okay, yeah. Call him DJ. Sorry. DJ, okay. <laughs> DJ. I don't know anyone, uh, everyone's name. Though, DJ. DJ, yeah. Yeah, he's a he's a talented kid. He's a big kid. And he's got length and he's got size too, so he's a good weapon down the middle for sure.